appeal for binoculars for the armed forces opened to a big audience on the second day of the Wellington Racing Club summer meeting at Trentham. A big crowd came to watch the races and see Major General Puttick receive the club's donation of a pair of field glasses to begin a big campaign successfully. Hart's fine run in the big race of the day put everyone in receptive mood for General Puttick's appeal for assistance. The army was there in force and it didn't need binoculars to see the Dunedin mayor winning all the way to a fine finish. But the forces do need binoculars for more important business. When Hearth had led the field back off the course, the racing club went to the right people with the right publicity for this important appeal. Mr. Eric Ridderford, president, made the Wellington Racing Club's donation to General Puttick, who thanked the club, explained the great need for instruments not now available from outside New Zealand, and said that he hoped the public would give, lend, or sell them to the government. The appeal had immediate results. First to follow the club's example was Beau Veet's owner, Mr. Ralph Stewart. On succeeding days, many others came forward, but the Army, Navy, and Air Force need more and more binoculars for active service. Their needs are urgent. They must have binoculars. They need all our binoculars. We can give them, lend them, or sell them, but we must do it now. Thank you.